All right, guys, welcome to another episode in the world of whatever we're doing today. But we have hit 10,000 subscribers. This is actually like crazy, bro. What are my notifications? <laughs> uh, how to suppress a scenario. I don't know what that means. Poll, what is the hardest win you've gotten? Mine is with Serbia. What is my hardest win in Age of History? I actually don't know. Uh, Probably with like Aragon or something at some point. Bro, we've hit 10,000 subscribers. I've been literally grinding out for 10k ever since I started this channel like seven years ago. Like I talked about uh, a couple months ago. And, you know, we've been making videos. And we've been making a lot of videos. This isn't even all my videos. I've made like over probably like 2,000 videos at this point. If you combine all the unlisted videos and all my channels and everything else. So, I've made tons and upon tons of videos. It's kind of crazy. Like, just looking through even, like, the last couple of years of what we've done is kind of cool. So I just want to say thank everybody for that, because 10k is such a huge milestone. We've been grinding out for that forever. And it did feel really cool when I hit that a couple days ago. I was, like, super happy from, like, ear to ear, uh, which usually is really rare. I didn't, I didn't think I'd be that happy when I hit 10k. I just thought I'd hit it and be like, oh, yeah, that's kind of cool. But I was really happy when I hit that for the first like hour or two but <laughs> then it faded off a little bit but we're jumping back into this video it's gonna be like a podcast type thing i'm gonna have timestamps in the description about all the things we're talking about it's gonna be like a big mega mega video i don't know the real thing is like what do i do now on youtube you know what i'm saying i hit 10k subscribers i said i was gonna switch the channel up do a lot of new things but <laughs> none of the new none of the new things i really had planned i really even think i want to do too much so I, it'll probably just stay about the same uh for the most part i don't know maybe i will switch some things up i think the first thing we're going to do is just kind of look through all these old videos we've been making for the past years and just kind of talk about the ones that i think were really cool obviously bro city a huge part of my channel we've been doing bro city for quite a while now it's been about three years uh, Bro City has really evolved into this world where I think it's really turned into like its own thing and I really like it. I've also, I've recently posted, uh, if you click this video and you go in the comments section, you can see the Planet Minecraft link, but I posted Bro City and a lot of other worlds to Planet Minecraft for you guys to download for free. That's up to you guys if you want to do that, but that is an option. For 10k subs, I decided to post all the worlds on Planet Minecraft. World Box has been another pretty big part of the channel, um, even though it's not the largest series on my channel. I really like World Box as one of those games that's kind of peaceful and calm. You can just have fun with it. We definitely need to do more content for it. I don't really do a whole lot of videos for it, but every now and then it is fun to jump into. This Earth Royale, this could become a series because this is something a lot of you guys actually seem to like, uh, the Earth Royale game. So I might actually make this a series on the channel. Uh, Age of History, obviously a mainline series. We've been doing Age of History for many years now, and I've made almost 200 videos in this game. So it's definitely like our one of our flagships. Rukoi is another flagship that we've played for just so long. Uh, and there's over 200 Rukoi videos I've made as well. Obviously the Cloud Realm was a huge server I was a part of, and I created uh, three seasons of Cloud Realm. And, I, well, I guess there was kind of four, but uh, Cloud Realm was a really cool thing. I'm really happy everybody who played in that. Obviously, the Among Us was a really cool thing as well. I didn't know I posted an Among Us video last year, though. That's kind of cool. I, I thought I abandoned Among Us, but apparently I have posted a video for it not that long ago. Among Us was a cool little series because it didn't last very long, but it was a it was a decent little timestamp in our in our journey. Growstone was another pretty interesting timestamp. I did a little bit of Fortnite here and there. That was fun. We played the Pixel Place. I uh, this was another pretty interesting little timestamp. We still have it up, technically, but I don't know. That's uh, up to you guys if you want to want me to bring this back or not. You can tell me in the comments. I have the largest Shuckle collection, or at least one of the largest. That's kind of cool. And then I, I did I ever show you guys that Charizard I got? I got like a really cool Charizard. Let me go to Twitter and I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. Also, follow my Twitter. 
Uh, yeah, here's my Charizard. It's pretty cool. Blue Blazin did not <laughs> did not ask. But that's my Charizard. Obviously, I've done tons of commentary videos for a long time. They're kind of fun to do every now and then. This is basically a commentary podcast video, so... I've done tons of random games over the years, like the Short Hike game. I've played the Political Machine. I've played Hearts of Iron 4. I've played tons of games that are just all in one playlist. Genshin Impact, we played that. I, I've played so many games you probably don't even know I've played them all. I've played Roblox on the channel. I've played all sorts of stuff on the channel, but that's kind of, you know, just kind of look, like a look back on memory lane of all the cool stuff like we've done or whatnot. You can look in the playlist channel uh, on my on my main channel. If you click the playlist section of my channel, it shows all the playlists. They're all pretty well organized for the most part channel series. And we got a lot of really cool series on the channel. A lot of these were really awesome to make. So definitely check a lot of these out. We have Gal Emulator too. I forgot all about this. We should probably make a new video of this because I haven't played this in who knows how long. It's been like two years. Two years since I've actually played this game. So that would be a good game to play as well. All right, everybody. The podcast will continue in Ruquan line as promised. Uh, what is deploy? What? Oh, I'm in the I'm in the the shop thing. I'm going broke in Rukoi. I don't know if I told you guys that. Also, they added this. They didn't even tell nobody they added this. They just kind of added this stuff randomly around Easter, and nobody really knew about it. This guy is a bunny. Um, I had a voice crack right there. That's awesome. This is like my skin, bro, but with a hood. I want to get this kind of... I don't know. I'm not going to pay for more gems. I did that to get my stats up. Uh, so now my stats are kind of close to level. People keep on saying I'm at like 200 stats, but they have gone up quite a bit, even though they're not at the same level. But I mean, it's, it's better than what it was at. You know what I'm saying? I, I feel like I kind of should get my stats up to to my level just to make everybody <laughs> everybody who says skill train to be quiet. I think that would be funny. But I don't really want to pay for gems either. We've been having some drama though lately in this uh, in this Rukoin line. Not with this guy. It's it's been with this this Doctor Boom guy, right? So a couple days ago, right? This Doctor Boom guy, he's talking to me on YouTube, right? And he says, right tonight, let's start, let's start some drama. And I'm like, bro, you're too poor to have drama with me. And then he's like, right tonight, you're too rich for me. And that is true. I got 800k in the bank, bro. Dr. Boom is going broke. Right tonight has all the, <laughs> all the high gold count in this game. And you know, people need to know that. But not Dr. Boom. Why is he start, starting to drama with me, bro? Why, why Dr. Boom starting drama with Raider right Knight for no reason, bro? I come back to the game for just podcast i'm just chilling out and then he trying to start drama with me if we want real drama with dr boom we should talk about how he's not in the discord server that's the that is the, <laughs> the real drama <laughs> no i'm actually i'm happy dr boom is back in this game because there's like nobody who plays ruko anymore except for me and maybe maybe blue blazon so having dr boom back in ruko is actually a good thing And I, I don't even really play this game either, so that's a lie. <laughs> I just hop on this thing for podcast, and that's about it. Oh, we're getting followed. We gotta run away. He's gonna he's gonna chase us. Oh, he's being nice to us. We have to say thanks. All right, should we go to the the rats? I saw Doctor Boom's video. He was doing the fucking rat farming, right? He only killed like ten thousand of them, which is not that much. We need to. Thanks for the starter guide. Yeah, no problem. We need to beat Dr. Boom. How do we get to like 100,000? Um, is there even a, a, a rank for that? I have no idea. Because Dr. Boom, he's trying to, you know, say he's the Rat King. We need to kill like 100,000 of these, right? Because Dr. Boom might be a war criminal. And that's like unironic. Until Dr. Boom rejoins the Cloud Gang Discord, 
which I don't I think he's still in the legacy discord but not the cloud gang one until he re rejoins the cloud gang discord we're going all out war with dr. boom or until we get an apology but now I'm getting off topic I need to talk about I wrote down like a hundred topics to talk about uh, another thing that happened lately was in age of history 2 I was on discord right and there's this giant mod in age of history 2 called TNO uh, it's like the biggest mod in, in Age of History, or at least one of the largest mods. And uh, <laughs> we, there's some drama with me and them. You know, I destroyed their server or whatnot, and, and there's some drama <laughs> there. I ain't gonna lie, the prank, the prank went a bit too far, but it was kind of funny. So basically, you know, I got admin, I deleted their general chat. Fast forward, they're not happy, I got banned from the server. I don't know if we can make <laughs> videos in the mod, to be honest. Because I feel like that would be, I don't know, that'd be kind of, uh, I don't know. Here, I'll tell you what, when we get unbanned from the server, if they unban us, right, we might make a video on the mod, I don't know. That'll be like our apology, right? We'll make a video on TNO, that'll be like our, our apology video, or whatever, for deleting the general chat. Let's go, bro, we are Rat Slayer now. We're gonna, we gotta beat Dr. Boom's record, right? So I'm gonna set this as my title. And, uh, yeah, we, we gotta beat Dr. Boom's record. That would... <laughs> if we kill 10,000 rats for 10,000 subscribers, that would equal us out to Dr. Boom. But we have to kill 100,000 rats. Maybe. I don't know. I probably won't actually do that. That'll be our drama with Dr. Boom. We just pass him in rat farming. I don't even know if there's a title for 100,000 rats, but we could find out. What are the, Like, what are the titles, actually? That's the better question. I have no idea. I don't even know how to check the titles, to be completely honest with you guys. I already talked about how I have all the uh, the Minecraft worlds on Planet Minecraft. I'm going to leave a link to that in the description um, of this video, so you guys can check that out. And then I'm also going to talk about the Discord server. I've been doing a lot of upgrades to it lately. Uh, so basically, there's like this giant forum on my Discord now. With like tons of music reviews, game reviews, and everything like that. And I've been like archiving a bunch of really cool pictures and content from the past or whatever. So if you guys want to join the Discord server, definitely join Cloud Gang. We're coming back strong. Actually, I'm really happy about like the new design of the server. It looks a lot nicer. We can talk about what else could we talk about? We can talk about some new movies that have come out. Um, the Spider Verse movie was really interesting. Uh, I was really disappointed though that it, it's a two-parter. But the movie itself is very good. I don't want to spoil nothing, so I'm not going to get super in-depth to it or whatever. I might spoil the Transformers movie that I watched, though. But for the Spider-Verse, the Spider-Verse movie was definitely, like, the best one that, I've, that has come out so far. As for the Transformers movie, it wasn't that bad, to be honest. It wasn't, like, the greatest movie of all time, but the new Transformers movie that came out yesterday or whatnot like it was actually a pretty solid uh transformers movie i wouldn't say it's the best one the third one is probably my favorite but this new transformers movie was not terrible they kind of they kind of brought like a lot of really cool stuff back and they really they kind of saved the franchise i'm not gonna lie also i have recently for 10k i also dropped a new lyric warlock lp so if you guys want to watch that uh that's on the lyric warlock channel that's out now so that's another thing I did for 10k. I've, I've done this podcast, I've put the Minecraft worlds on Planet Minecraft, and then I did the Lyric War like LP. So that's like been my big 10k celebration uh, type thing that I've done. I was going to record this podcast yesterday, I remember. But I was like, I'm not, a, I'm not really in a good mind space to do the podcast. Yesterday I was definitely not... And I was like, you only get one chance to record a really good video for like 10k, so I wanted to be in a better area to record it. So I waited another day, and then today is when I'm recording it. I, I think so far the video has gone relatively well. I wanted it to be in Rukoi, and I could have done the 10k in uh, Age of History, but I just felt like Rukoi, the podcast, uh, would be like a good, a good way to do it. Because I wanted it to be like a long video. I know for like all my other celebrations, I just said thank you, and that was about it. And I mean, I like those, but I feel like doing like a full podcast for it just is more enjoyable. It's more memorable too. We could get into like the VC with some people, 
if I really wanted to, and we could like talk about the 10k thing, but I don't know, I kind of want to keep it solo, we'll see, we'll see what I do, but we haven't even killed a thousand of these rats yet, they're not spawning quick enough, it's kind of disappointing, don't worry, NA4 is a 100% judgment free server, that's a lie, <laughs> bro, they are, they are capping right now, I don't know if I told you guys this, but I'm a melee player in this game now. If you look at my stats, melee is above distance, technically. <laughs> Surveyor Knight is technically a melee player uh, for the second time in history uh, in Rukoi, which is kind of funny. The main reason I've been switching to melee is because I, I don't really play this game on a tablet a whole lot, and melee is also just better for the higher level mobs, I've noticed. And, and I needed defense, and I needed a stronger melee. I just felt like I don't know. I just felt like that was the right stat to go with. Especially with how much has changed in the game. You have a higher defense when you when you use melee. And all the new mobs that come out are always high level. Uh, and very powerful. So unless you have a team, you're not going to be able to farm them very efficiently. Now, in terms of PvP, I would say Mage is probably still the strongest class. Uh, distance is not that good in PvP unless like maybe really specific scenarios where you're like, I don't know, where you're trying to like kite people in the stairs maybe. But even then, even then you can kite people pretty well with the, with the, the mage because mage can shoot people when they're not even in your radar of the map. If you hit the, uh, the farthest part of the map, you can attack people. So mage is kind of broken in that as aspect. How long did it take Dr. Boom to kill all the rats to get to 10,000? I don't even know. Probably was grinding this shit for like a couple hours or something. We gotta get to 100, we gotta get to 100,000 just to fuck with him. <laughs> that would be fucking hilarious. Rukoi needs rusted horseshoes. I don't even know what that is. There's not horses in the game. Or is it because your name is Horse? I don't know, bro. Didn't they add... They added, like, templates to this game, right? Presets, yeah. I, I did that with my presets. I did my melee one and my, my distance one. You can buy more. I need to get a uh, mage one set up, don't I? Oh, fuck. Do I even have mage armor anymore? I thought I did. I guess not. Who's all online? None of my friends are ever online no more. We need to get people back in Rukoi, you know what I'm saying? Or we need to, also we need to, everybody who changed their name, right? They need to go back to their OG name. That's also a problem. Like, a lot of these people, well, I don't know, like this guy, right? He changed his name, I don't know who he is now. This guy changes his name. Who else has changed their name? I don't know who this is. They changed their name as well. You see, that's the biggest problem is when people change their name, we don't know who they are no more. We need to ban name changing in Rukoi. Or you know what? They need to do what they did on Twitter. <laughs> when you click the name, it has the, the username and then it has the at of what they are. That way you always know who is who. That'd be funny. Nah, though, why, why though, bro? Why do they, everybody gotta change their name all the time in this game? Let's go, bro. Rat Slayer 2. We killed a, 500 of them. Let's go. Dr. Boom ain't got nothing on us, bro. I know a lot of you guys have been wondering, like, Raider Night, why are you posting less? This is, I just have not been in the mood to post videos lately. I don't know why. I know the Minecraft, Minecraft updated recently, and they added the cherry trees and all that other stuff. I've been playing a lot of that. That's been a lot of fun. I've been doing some stuff like upgrading Breast City in that Minecraft world. We did a realm, or no, we did like an actual straight up server, but it didn't do that well. So I, that kind of left me bummed out. And there's been a lot of other factors of just like real life bumming me out lately. So that's the main reason I haven't been posting a whole lot. But I, I have made a lot of videos lately that I was going to edit after this video. But I, I, was, I was holding off posting this, making this video until I was happier to, to make this video. Talk about music also. Uh, so, 
I think I talked about this in the last podcast. It's still not out. We're still waiting for Travis to drop. We're still ra- waiting for, for Uzi to drop. We're still waiting for everybody to drop, bro. Nobody is dropping music. And it's like, bro, we need <laughs> we need more music. Nobody's dropping. And it's kind of sad. I'm not going to lie. You know who else we need back in Rukoi? We need to bring Ashton back. And we need to bring Plaza back. And we need to bring... Who else do we need to bring back? We need Puppy Bark unbanned, bro. When they banned Puppy Bark from this game, Rukoi fell off. Everybody knows it's true. Uh, when they ban <laughs> when they banned Puppy Bark, this game fell off. We need to bring Critical back to this game. When they banned Critical, this game fell off. Everybody knows it. Also, we need to leg- legalize botting in this game so they can unban Puppy Bark. Technically, they already have botting. You can AFK everything now. That 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 means Puppy Bark should be unbanned be- by default because <laughs> the botting, you know, it makes no sense, bro. Unban Puppy Bark from the game. Free Puppy Bark. We're gonna get a trending on Twitter. That's really, bro, why why did they ever ban Puppy Bark from this game? I, I literally, I thought about just straight up botting in this game and getting banned in protest. <laughs> Cause that would be funny, that would be funny too. Bro, Dr. Boom definitely was farming this for hours, bro. He, he went to 10K in the, the rats, right? So he's been, he was grinding this shit for fucking hours. Cause what are we at? We're at like maybe about a thousand, right? And we've been we've been recording this for about an hour. So Dr. Boom, he straight up was farming these fucking rats for for 10, 12 hours straight, bro. <laughs> if you, if you want to go to a hundred k rats, you got to be in here for fucking over a hundred hours. Just for the fucking role, bro. Just for that little title. Bro, Dr. Boom really, he really said, he really, he really came, <laughs> he really, he, he really sat down and he said, you know, bro, I'm just going to farm the rats for 10 hours straight. <laughs> I mean, that's dedication right there. I don't know. If like, if he did a podcast with it, like maybe that would make sense. But he, no, he sat there alone <laughs> for 10 hours straight farming the fucking rats, bro. You know, at least for me, right? We're doing the podcast thing. So it actually makes sense. Bro, every time I do the podcast, I'm going to be farming the rats until we pass Dr. Boom. We're going to 100k. I'm not even joking. I'm trying to think of what else we could talk about. Kind of exhausted every point. I mean, we could talk about like YouTube itself. It's just gotten so stale lately. Like nobody's posting. All the videos that people are posting are like for kids nowadays. It's like all all dumbed down content. I mean, you already know that, but it feels like the only channel left that has survived is maybe Raider Knight and a couple other channels. Like this is the future of YouTube. You know what I'm saying? Like if you're subscribed to Raider Knight, you're probably pretty intelligent because you're you're saving the integrity of the platform in a sense. Nah, bro. Fuck this level one, bro. He's he's straight up taking our our fucking money, bro. He's taking our rats. I want to at least get to a thousand, bro, for this video. But I, I don't know if I'm going to be able to actually get to a thousand of them. Bro, Dr. Boom straight up said he was botting the rats, bro. Is that what he did? Was he botting the rats? Do we have proof of that? Can we ban this guy? I'm joking. <laughs> bro, if he got banned for fucking botting the rats, this game is going to hell. I'm not even joking with you guys. Look, bro, he's in the game right now, bro. I'm gonna I'm tell him, bro. I'm gonna tell you, 10k rats ain't nothing. <laughs> I'll put that in the I'll put that in the chat, bro. Put, put 10k rats ain't nothing. <laughs> should I be mean? Should, should I put try try 10k try get try getting 10k subscribers? <laughs> should I do that? That'd be fucking mean. <laughs> <laughs> this drama is not even real. It's just for fun. Nah, you know what? Fuck it. It's for the video. It's for the video. We gotta do it. Let's see what he says, bro. Let's see what he says. We're starting drama in Rukoi. This this root drama don't even exist. Me and Dr. Boom are cool. But this is kind of funny. Nah, guys. It, like, jokes aside, if you guys want to subscribe to Dr. Boom, definitely do. Um, subscribe to everybody in the Rukoi community, to be honest. Who doesn't 
who's pro Raider Knight. If they're anti Raider Knight, fuck them. <laughs> but if, if they're pro Raider Knight, you know, we're supporting them. Bro, how do we how do we player kill people in this area? This guy is taking all of our rats, he's he's ruining the, the, the grind, you know what I'm saying? Bro, we we've, we've been just talking the whole time and the chat is so edgy though. <laughs> Have you like bro, like dead ass though. Like do you guys fuck with the Rukoi chat being edgy? I know that's how it's always been, but I don't know. That's like part of the Rukoi cult culture, to be honest. It's Rukoi, Rukoi chat is one of the edgiest in, in gaming, which is probably a good thing. Like, if Rukoi went boring, I don't know if it would be the same. And I will say, it, like, that time period where the chat was just dead all the time, that was terrible. I will say the chat is more active than it used to be, to be fair. Because there was like a couple years, right, where like you'd get in the game and nobody would chat because everybody was just AFK botting. And that's that's kind of how it was for like the longest time. We had a thousand rats. Let's go. Does it announce in the chat when I when I kill 10,000 of these things? Bro, if we killed 100,000 of these rats, bro, Dr. Boom would be done, bro. He would have to apologize immediately. We would get such the W from that. It's not even funny. But nah, bro. Dr. Boom literally, bro. He was sitting here for 10 hours farming the rats. Like, that's not a joke. He was sitting here for 10 hours straight, alone, talking to nobody, farming the rats. Nah, I can't even say anything, bro. I would sit in the fucking lizards for who knows how long. Every time I played this game, bro. Because I have, like... I don't even know how many hours in this game, right? It's like... What is it, 4,000 hours in Rukoi? Something like that. Every time I got on this game, bro, I would sit in the lizard all day long. And I would just farm the lizard 3 route all day long. And that's how I got major that's how I got all my levels, to be completely honest with you guys. It was just farming the fucking lizards. Like literally every level I have can basically be attributed to the lizards. <laughs> Every, every level after like 170 was all lizards. We need to get more gold though, I will say that. I am going broke in Rukoi. I need gold, we need to scam people. Maybe we need to bring back scamming, I don't know. We might have to. <laughs> I don't know if it'd work as good nowadays, but you know, we might have to bring it back, I'm not gonna lie. Bro, I wish I could just fucking take this guy out. He's level 10, he's trying to take our rats. It's kind of fucked up, I'm not gonna lie. Alright bro, you ain't taking our rats, go somewhere else, go back to wherever you came from, we don't like you. We need to ban everybody from rats for Raider Knight. They need to expand rats, make it like huge bro. We need like rats 3, rats 4, <laughs> rats 5. Bro, imagine if the fucking final boss of Rukoi was the Rat King though. Like that would be kind of crazy. They should do that. Just the final boss of Rukoi be like a giant rat king or something. Or who would- what would be the final boss? Like if there was a final boss of Rukoi, what would you guys actually want it to be? Would it just be the Cerebrus? Because I'm pretty sure that's the strongest boss, right? Or would it be like the demon boss? Or what would it actually be? And what would it drop? What would it drop to? Like what would your dream Rukoi update, update be? Like be completely honest with me. Cause I don't even know what I would add. I, I would probably add like, I don't know. This game doesn't really need anything, you know what I'm saying? It, well, it does, but maybe like the guilds, you know what, fuck it. Put the guilds in like the actual thing, because it, it never made sense for it to be on the website, because that's dumb. Do that, um, what else could we do? Make more deck, you know, decorate the map better, because there's like no decorations on this map, and there never has been. Uh, do that. Uh, fix the lizards a little bit. Because I don't like how it's set up. Not like lizard 3 or lizard... Lizard 2 is fine also, but... I'm talking lizard 1, bro. Nobody likes it. At least I don't. I don't know. I don't like how it's set up. How it's like split in the middle. How you can't go nowhere. I don't, I don't really like that. But yeah, man. This is Raider Knight. We were talking to Dr. Boom. He never responded, but... Raider Knight, 10k subscribers, we did it, finally after all these years of grinding, I just want to say thank you guys once again, 
thank you guys for sticking with the podcast if you're still watching to the end of this video and we will see you all for the next one peace